Hi, I'm Matt Balm and welcome back to the Bomb Movies presentation of Rise of the Tomb Raider. Okay, here we are with Lara. We're at the uh, the train yard now, I believe. Still in search of the Divine Source. And uh, Trinity are way ahead of us. So, uh, just to recap, we're playing on Survivor difficulty. So, every little resource helps, including bunnies. So, we're going to loot absolutely everything we come across. We're not going to spend too long looking for stuff. But what we do find, we will get. And I seem to be a lot better at shooting bunnies in this one than I was in 2013. Just make sure we've got everything in the immediate vicinity. Okay, looks like we've got to climb up this tower. Okay, it's pointing down here and so is this rope, but before we go down the rope, this looks like there's likely to be stuff down here, so let's look for the stuff that's down here. There we go, there's a map. New document and mural locations revealed. Okay, now we need to climb back up. I wonder if we can get up the same way we drop down. Hopefully we can. No, it doesn't look like we can. Okay. Over the fence then. Right. Use this zip line. Okay, missions. Assisting allies will yield beneficial rewards. Okay, apparently there is an ally nearby. Obviously killed those two Russian guys. Don't shoot. I'm not your enemy. Okay, if I could actually see where you were up there. I think. Not quite sure, actually. Well, we'll pop this open. Can we pop this open? No, missing gear. Need a lockpick. Ah, hello. Who are you, people? All that can come later. If you want answers, then listen close. We've managed to destroy the old radio tower, but there are repeaters that keep them connected. We need to shut them down. Help me, and I'll let the others know they can trust you. We need all the allies we can get. Um, mission reward lockpick. Yes, communication spray down. Of course, I'll I need a lockpick. We don't have much time. Destroy the comms towers, okay. Optional mission indicators. Survival instinct can highlight locations and objects critical to completing missions. Aha. So all those green flashing dots. It looks like there's another camp I need to light, but it's using up the wood that I've got. Roth is determined that I should learn how to shoot. However, he tried to teach me today. I was utterly hopeless. I've always said in the field you can't go wrong with a stout stick and good boots. I told him I was a man of words, not of weapons. He laughed and said that he hoped I could find the right words to slow down a charging bison. I told him that's what he was for. Bless him for trying, though. I don't think there'll be any more lessons somehow. Roth always said I must have gotten my sharp eyes and steady hands from Mum. That summer, he taught me to shoot instead. I took to it. Maybe too well. Well, the way we've been killing bunnies this time round, we're doing all right. Okay. So, region summary, not a lot done, which uh, isn't surprising. Can't jump up there. Have you done it? No, I haven't done it. Give me a chance. I haven't found them all yet. But I will. Give me a chance, man. You've only just asked me. Okay. What was this? I've infiltrated the ranks of the enemy and learned that they come seeking the rich resources of the mountain. 
They appear to know nothing of the secret we protect. Those who build the Iron Road are themselves prisoners, slaves of the Red Army. Massive machines now use the Iron Road, bringing more slaves, food, and raw materials for construction of a small city. It is time for me to return to my people so we might plan our attack. If we can inflict heavy losses upon them before they reach the mountain, they may give up and turn back. Okay, from his description, it sounds like the Soviets built a railroad directly to the mountain. Fine. I can now translate level 2 Russian. Alright, let's go up here. Laura, why aren't you walking up there? You too cold or something? Oh, there we go. Good resources. I probably need to make more arrows. There we go. Ah, go round and then up again. Okay. Oh, that's um, healing herbs. Okay. So we've got some more bits and pieces around here. Ah, another tomb nearby. Read this book first. We were fools. Careless, arrogant fools. We thought we could stop them, but the Red Army outnumbers us. Their weapons are superior, and they just keep coming. Many of my people, including myself, have been captured, forced to work the mines of our own mountain. It's only a matter of time before they discover our secret. When this happens, we must be ready. He mentions their secret. Was it? What is it they protect in these mountains? Okay. Yes. What is it indeed? Log pick, probably. Yeah. Have I got to do some sort of mini game when I get the log pick? Okay. I wonder where the optional tomb is. Up there. Somewhere up there. Over there. There's a herby bush. This looks likely. Explore caves in the Soviet installation. So I've uh, just noticed that Lara's axes are different with this uh, outfit. <laughs> That's quite cool. But she's still colder than she would be, wouldn't she? I mean, she's kind of wearing like a... Need to get more information out of the prisoner. If Constantine has to do it himself, he's not going to be happy. We'll step up the pressure, but he's clearly had some experience with interrogation techniques before. We think he's the leader of the Remnant. He has to know about the Divine Source. Find his weakness. Get creative. This prisoner... Maybe I can find him. Okay, gotta find a prisoner. Yeah, so Laura's outfit kind of looks like a 
cut down version of something someone would wear in the Game of Thrones. Or the Stormcloak uniform from uh, Skyrim. It's pretty cool, I like it. And I've got no idea that we're supposed to be going down this way, but... I'm trying to find the tomb. This does look like a tomb. Damien, the Prophet's Forge. Okay, that improved our Greek. Now, it looked like there was a way we could go this way, but I don't know whether I can jump over there. No, it's just showing somewhere where we can go. This cool stuff everywhere. I don't think I can get up there. Cities are not built on plans alone. There must be material, and there must be someone who knows how to build. Damien was that man. They say he could muster brick from nothing more than a handful of dirt and a tinderbox. They say his craftsmanship was divinely inspired. It is his hand that gave form to the architect's dreams. Okay. I can't get up there. I must have to swim this way. I love the way the metal shimmers there. Right, so I can get back down into the water. I don't think I really need to. Is this where I saw that tomb? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, interesting. Drop down or jump across? Just drop down to there. Before we do that, let's get the stuff around the uh, circumference of this round room. Okay, let's have a look. <laughs> Ancient bow part. Awesome. 3,000 credits earned. Uh, I don't know what that means, but yeah, ancient bow part. That sound good. So this was like a secret tomb place thingy. Okay, good. So we go back this way and back out the same way we came. I didn't read the bit from that last note, although I don't even remember which one it was now. Damien, wasn't it? Cities are not built on pl Does building a city like Kitesla would take many skills and talents. The prophet lauded every contribution. I need to listen to when someone says that name of the city again because I can't remember how you pronounce it. Kitesla? I don't know. Still. We shall find out. She could have gone through that gap a bit quicker. It wasn't that small. Right, nothing there. Okay. That was worthwhile to find the ancient bow part. And now we're back in the freezing cold. Okay. Right. So I think we got everything out of this hut here. There's stuff over there. Oh, I didn't want to go down there. Can I get up here? Yep. Yeah. Oh, wolves. OK, 
Okay, it looks like they can't jump little hills, little um I can't think of the word. They can't jump. Right. Little platforms. Little rocky platforms. There we go. Another map. Okay. More documents and murals. Can I get over there? No. No, there was another wolf in there as well. Let's be prepared. Be prepared to kill a wolf. How many is there? No, not good. Run, run, run. Okay, that wasn't good. Trinity is after the source. I should find out what they know. Yes, we should, Lara, but I'm more interested in killing these two wolves. Where did they go? Bit worried about going all the way down there. Maybe I should just go down there and wait and see. They've got to be down this way. I just can't see a thing. News is getting more and more tense. There's one. I think I got them both. Okay. You can see their eyes glowing in the dark. Right. Now there's got to be something worthwhile in here, surely. Not just a mutilated deer. Okay, way out here. This is back where we came, isn't it? Nothing in there, really? Oh well. Some mushrooms. Death cat mushrooms. It sounds like there's even more wolves. Okay. Oh, outside there's even more walls. Can I do that? Yeah. Right, where is this tomb then? Um. Don't know. Up there? Sorry, Lara. Okay. Hopefully it's up here. There's a camp up here.
Okay, I've got upgrades available for the inventory and upgrades for the weapons. I haven't upgraded anything in the inventory yet, so... We can do equipment. What can we do? A satchel. Increases resource storage capacity. That's probably useful. Let's do that. Okay. Can I do weapons as well? No. Fine. Let's go down here. I hope this is a tomb. Nope. But a nice little place. With nothing in it. Something in the corner there? Really? There's absolutely nothing in it? Okay, maybe it's that guy's little home. Oh! Oh, I was trying to be clever and jumping on the roof. That was a bit silly. I don't know where this tomb is. Maybe I should look at the map. Oh, it's there, look. <laughs> Could have looked at the map all along. What a wally. Right, fine. Um, set a waypoint of that, although there is a communications tower to get rid of there. But I do want to try out this tomb. So that's the comms tower, that glowing thing. How do I destroy them, I wonder? Communication repeaters. Trinity must have installed these. That's how. One down. Ah, wolves. Another wolf den down there, another comms tower up there. Let's just have a look at the map. I'm right next to where the tomb is. Okay. Maybe there's a way to get up to the old prison. Ah. Ah, opens up the tomb. I missed him. Okay, got a skill point that was worth shooting that for then. Oh, I keep hurting Lara. Lara, skin the animals. Oh, I'm going to have to check this place out now. Killed them all, have I? Maybe? Although they did seem to come back before. I think these are just like little optional areas. And definitely hear something. It's actually quite nerve-wracking, you know, and playing on survivor mode in these these tunnels. I'm kind of nervous about it because I can't see anything. And those wolves aren't exactly uh, friendly. stuff to salvage over there.
Right, let's go do this too. Or go and destroy that first. Let's go and destroy that second comms tower. There's a good view from the top here. Okay. Um. There we go. down. Okay, so I can go down there and collect that stuff, but I would rather go and do that over there. Am I going to die? Oh, you wally. No, I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Um, maybe I shouldn't jump down there though. Right, let's go do this tomb. These markings, they're not Russian. Warning, maybe? A warning? Okay. There's the tomb entrance. But before we go into the tomb entrance, just have a look at the rest of this cave. So I've done four out of the five caves in this area, that's cool. might be indicative of the rest of the game because this is actually quite a well quite a lot in this the small area maybe i can find constantine's prisoners followers he must know something cool she could speak uh, saying two things at the same time that's clever <laughs> have to try that myself myself okay okay Right. Looks like this was abandoned in a hurry. Did the Soviets find something down there? Let's go find out, Laura. Unknown area, optional There's challenge. There's water team. down below. Sounds like a great volume. Crystal clear water. Look at that reflection. I'm thinking maybe I should heal myself. with an image of a city stamped in gold. And there's the prophet. This was likely an official coin of Kitesh. Kitesh. Ah, Kitesh. That's it. Kitesh. I was waiting for Lara to say that. Kitesh. <laughs> Oh. 
Fine. What have we got here? The Prophet's icon cast in gold. Bling. The metal workers of the city started to develop their own style, but it's still similar to Byzantine craft work. It's awesome. Is what it is. Right, looks like we have a puzzle. Hmm. That's got to be part of the works. Um, right. Oh, I think I timed that well. Let's sort your hair out, Lara. Okay. What's in here? to shoot the oil cask? Probably. Arrows. Can I shoot it with an arrow? Yes. But the tombs are far more elaborate, aren't they? Right, base camp. I'm running out of wood. Okay, I know we've got skill points to use. Right, um, Survivor. Land safely without damage from substantial heights, press B to roll when landing. That's probably a good idea. Yep. Considering the last two times I've been hurt, it's because of me jumping off things. Right, weapon upgrades, um, handgun, although I'm not interested in that. Let's have a look. Reckoner, an ancient Byzantine warrior melee weapon. Any available wearing the Hope's Bastion outfit? That's what that axe is. The Reckoner. I can upgrade the Reckoner. On the edge. Oh, it looks like it's transferable. The sharpened edge allows the blade to slide farther into gaps, improve leverage, and increase speed. Alright. Right, now what do we do? What do we do this way, I think? Water's eroding everything. At this rate, there won't be much left in a few decades. Ancient sister. It's a sister. Right, let's figure this one out then. Oh, let's try not to jump off the edge. Right, something tells me it's not going to be that easy. No, didn't think so. Okay, get back up. So, by the looks of it, we've got to raise the water level. How do we raise the water level? That way, I think. Crystal clear water, absolutely. Right, there's one of those things that you've got to blow up with the oil um, canisters. And there's an oil canister. That's handy. Okay, so let's let the water out. So now what do we do? Go back. We can go through here. Let's 
back into the main room. Yes. Now we can go over there. Alright, so we've got to blow that one up. How do we blow that one up? Markings on the wall. The levels change. Yeah, figure that one out already, Lara. Thank you. Um, what does this do? Okay. I've got to time it. Got to time it. Right. Missed it. Missed. That's gone back to there, but at least I can throw this on it easily. Okay. Get out of the water, right? Okay, now we've got to time it. And blow it up. Okay, should be able to swim through now. Swim through. Some sort of mincer there. Ooh. Hope that's not Lara getting minced. Right, what's in here? There's something up there. This should be more than enough oil to light the passages below. But be careful transporting it. We have not perfected the refining process, and it is still volatile. You will know the man who supervises the construction. We all do. Without his knowledge of the Earth, none of us would have survived along the difficult journey. Do not linger. And if he asks for word of his wife and child, feign ignorance. He cannot accept that they perished during our exodus, and expects them to arrive any day. We need his genius, and I fear if he saw the truth, we might lose him entirely. Okay, so they were instructions to deliver oil to the workers below and not to upset the foreman. No warning. Okay, I'm quite enjoying this puzzle. Another barrier. But how can I get to this one? Okay. Something else to collect there first. Wall. I need to get an oil canister into here somehow. So they respawn. Okay, so I think I've got to throw it up there. Get on. And throw. And then jump. Yes. 
It worked. Go. Oh. Um, there. Is that it? Looks likely. Can I get out that way? Is there something I can do that way? Look at that. Awesome stuff. That was a good puzzle. I enjoyed that. Nothing like a good puzzle. Skill Master's natural instincts. Nearby resources will automatically appear on the map and glow when nearby. Awesome. Awesome. Tomb complete. Ancient sister. Okay. Um, I think it was this way. Whoa. Let's not forget the other stuff. Any more stuff? Nah. Right. So it's this way to get out. So the tombs are a lot more enjoyable in this one. It's a slower paced game though than the first 2013. Maybe because I'm playing on survivor mode. Okay, just wanted to make sure we were saved at the camp. I'm glad I went down into this tomb now. Almost fell then, that would be good. <coughs> Fine. I should have tried out the new roll that I did, shouldn't I? That I got on my last skill point expenditure. I can drop from height and do a skillful little action roll. Can I do it just from jumping? Yeah, I can. Look at that. Cool. Right. Soviet installation. Get up there, swing across. Oh! Alright, don't swing across. Still managed to get where I wanted to go. What's in here? A family photograph. Russian, late 1950s. Perhaps one of them was imprisoned here. Something's written here. Remember. Remember, remember the Soviet December. Okay.
Right, various things to do in here. Um, I'm not really sure. Why are they glowing? Why is that glowing? Why is that glowing? And what is that? The stuff I shoot? It's not. Do I need fire arrows? Probably need fire arrows. Yeah. Go up further here. Another Soviet box. Soviet box of delight. Compound bow part. Awesome. So I found an ancient bow part and a compound bow part. Because I do love my bows. Oh, didn't want to do that. Okay. No, no, oh, I can't jump up there. Doesn't let me jump up there. Can jump back across to here. But the music heating up is generally because there are wolves in the area. So, we won't go to the ground, we shall use the handy ropes. Why are there all these ropes here? Did they go, oh, Lara Croft's coming. Let's put up some ropes so she can climb. Yeah, that's what they did, wasn't it? Obviously what they did. They did it for Lara. Oh, don't need any feathers. Let's, um... Get some feathers now. Okay, so I can jump across to that branch. Up to here. Need rope arrows. There's the last cave down there. No! Oh, I tried to get on that thing, but I missed. Okay. Another tomb? Really? Okay. Just there, look. Lots of tombs. Okay, there's another communications thing up there. Let's go up there. Okay, so we need two more of those. Um, can I get up the tree? I know I was going to go into that cave, but I got sidetracked again. Oh no, 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 no. Can I not get on that? No, I can't. Oh. All right, let's go down into the cave. Remember to do the combat roll. A combat roll of action. This has got to be the last cave, surely, in the area. Four out of five. There we go. Challenge complete. But it's an exploration. Use credits to purchase card packs in the marketplace. What are card packs? That's some sort of trading thing. I need more equipment to do this area. I need rope arrows to open that. I think I'm going to have to do what I did in my last Let's Play of Tomb Raider is come back to these areas later.
just need to see where the uh, next two comms towers are. The last two comms towers. I want to do that and go back to talk to the guy. Climb up, Lara. Okay, new base camp. Oh, I've got no wood. Is there wood in here? No. Wood in here? No. Come, sir. Okay, so I've got one more of those to do. I need some wood to do this ham. There's probably some wood down there. So how far can I do this jump and roll? Let's have a look. Oh, not that far. I need more trees to do the camp. I've got to do that last communication post as well. But I need more trees to do the camp. Here's a tree to do the camp. Okay, cool. Got the tree to do the camp. I've got the tree to do the camp. Right. Oh, goes the communications outpost. Cool. Right, now I can go and talk to that guy. What's that? Remnant General. Okay. Oh, three of four semi auto parts. That's good, but I thought it was only three bits needed. How wrong was I? Okay. Combat knife is required to cut rope. Fine. There's an awful lot of stuff you need to do this. A small, intricate clockwork toy, made of bits of scrap metal and other detritus, all from the gulag. Must have taken a long time to gather the parts. Detritus, what a cool word that is. Detritus. There's razor blades on that thing. Okay. Rope arrows. Oh, stop it, Lara. Okay. Let's go in here. Oh, I need explosives. Can't go in there. Let's go and talk to this general. I've got enough wood for the camp down the other way, but I think really we should go and talk to the remnant general. Oh, there's a monolith there. Can't do the monolith. There's way too much stuff everywhere. And I've got a skill point. Not quite confident enough with my Russian to make this out. Level but three. It seems to show a map of some sort. Need level three Russian for that. Okay, cool. What was that thing? Was that a deer? Have you done it? Yes, I have. Are the transmitters destroyed? Yeah, we're just killing a deer. 
Oh. He fell through the holes in the fence. Huh? Okay. The repeaters are offline. It's done. So it is. We don't have much to spare. But if you're fighting with us, you can use this. Awesome! Lockpick. Cool. A makeshift lockpick that allows Lara to open padlocks found on some chests and doors. I can't remember where I found them now. I completed the mission. We just hold it, look. No minigame. Okay, good. I'm glad there's no minigame. New gear pistol unlocked. Awesome. So is that the semi-auto pistol that was the last part? We've got the revolver and we've got the semi-auto pistol. So have I got these guns as well? I have! Ah. Awesome, the Venom Hand Cannon. The Moon Shadow. Matte black semi-automatic heavy pistol with an ivory grip inlay. And the Acipita Nox. Okay. That's a bit ridiculously huge, that gun, isn't it? Looks a bit silly on Lara. Let's have a look at the Venom hand cannon. That's awesome. Doesn't really suit Lara, though. Yeah, it kind of does. That's awesome. Limited ammo capacity doesn't stop this pistol from dealing heavy damage. Yeah, you. Awesome. Okay, hollowed hammer. Lighter hammer allows for less jammy routing, higher rates of fire. Lighter to all pistols. Cool. Oh. Okay, and we've got the skill. Brawler skills, let's have a look. Oh, level 2 brawler skills. Deadly force. Stealth finishes are much faster and kill enemies. Brutal force. Press Y to kill nearby unaware enemies. Stealth landing. Enemies from jumps to drops are always, is always silent and generates no noise for enemies to detect. That might be useful. Build medic. Bandage moves more quickly. Effective. Effect is cumulative with the fast healer skill. Where is the fast here, this girl? Don't know. I'm gonna do that like Build Medic. Awesome. Okay, I think we just need to make our way back to the other camp. I've got the wood for it. Squirrel! I'm glad it now glows. Different resources. Where do we actually need to go? Over there. Okay. Stop! I saw a tree somewhere. There's lots of trees now. And there's somewhere to go up there, but I don't think we should really be going that way because it's telling me to go that way. So that's the way we're going to go. And that's up near the camp that I need to... Restart its fire. Oh, 
people had a bow then, but I didn't. I had the hand cannon. Oh, thought it was going to keep running that way, but it didn't. Oh well. And stop wasting ammo. Okay, so now we can do the camp. I hope you received my last tape in good time. I am becoming increasingly fond of recording these messages to you. Anna says that I need time away from my books and papers every so often, if only to remember why I'm doing all this. I know you hate me going away, but it will be worth it one day. It will all be worth it. Sending my love to you. Work hard in school. I know your work was important, but it didn't feel like it at the time. Still, it taught me independence. How to look after myself. Important lessons, as it turns out. Okay, so here we are at Sheltered Ridge. Let me just have a look at the quests. Story objective, find a way into the old prison. So I need to head west of where I am. To make a way into the old prison. And, you've guessed it, we're going to be doing that a little bit later